South African scientists are taking a closer look at the fragments of a meteorite, provisionally named the Nkweba meteorite, after the nearby town of its discovery, which fell in August. This is very exciting, and especially in a South African context, because um, a lot of the planetary research is not done in, in Africa. And having an opportunity to contribute to planetary research in South Africa and an African context is fantastic. Nkweba has been linked to one of the biggest asteroids in the universe. It belongs to maybe uh, a, a subgroup of meteorites that maybe make up less than 10% of all the meteorites that we've ever collected on Earth. And so it's special right, for, right from the word go. We think it is probably part of the soil, the impact churn soil from a large body in the asteroid belt called Four Vesta. Uh, the second largest body in the asteroid belt. Meteorites are the building blocks of planets. They can be potential threats to Earth, but also provide valuable insights into the galaxy. We're seeing a rock that's not got a lot of iron in it, which tells us it was probably from near the surface of a body that essentially went through the same history as Earth, uh, but did it much quicker before it was broken up and now those pieces are coming to us. So we're looking right back into our distant past to about 4.56, 4.57 billion years ago when our solar system actually was born. The rock is being carefully studied and will soon be classified in the global database run by the Meteoritical Society. We need to take a little bit of the material that we have and make uh, thin sections. So we cut it really, 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 really thin, so thin that you can see light through the rock. And using these very thin samples, we're able to look at the minerals, classify what they are, and then put them into advanced uh, instrumentation to get the composition. WITS University is one of a few internationally accredited institutions that tracks meteorite falls and finds in the country. South Africa has been impacted by several meteorites throughout history. The last find was 50 years ago in Lichtenberg in the northwest province. Sharon Baranga, CGTN.